You know, when the pandemic hit, we saw an obvious need to support the local community. Arriving each day by the busloads, these youngsters from Freeport's Mast Landing and Moore Street schools won't be welcomed by the traditional school bell, but instead a chorus of... You know, a lot of school districts don't have 600 acres to play on, um, and so it just seemed like an obvious choice for us to be that space for them. Molly Sear manages Wolf's Neck's farm camp. Creating the Farm Discovery School last fall, it proved to be so successful, it's back for another 12-week spring session. On days these students are scheduled for half-day remote learning, they come here for the second half. In order for the schools to say that their students are back full-time five days a week, um, they're utilizing us as part of that time. While the kids do have plenty of fun time, they are here to learn. The program centers on specific areas, including animal science, outdoor living skills, and ecology, both woods and water. It's education through exploration. Drew Gallant is one of the instructors. They're also exploring together, and that's a lot of social emotional learning that they might not get in a traditional school setting right now. Spring is such an awesome time of year to be here because we've got not only things getting planted, but we've got a lot of animals being born. So that's a new aspect for them to experience as well. While not a conventional classroom, in this unconventional year of learning, Wolf's Neck is offering these K through fifth graders a rare experience, a close up experience with the outdoors and nature. Having this opportunity for them to get away from those screens and get back to being a kid and being outside and being hands-on has been a huge help for them. And this current spring session runs until June 4th.